This is our New Year's Eve, New Year's special on Milka Mafia, and tonight we have an interesting little um, bit we're going to do for you. Over the past few months, we have interviewed a lot of different guests, and tonight, instead of trying to uh, play film of a year in review of those guests, we've invited every single one of those guests back, and we're going to interview them in a rapid style succession, one after another, asking them one random question, and then once they answer it as quickly as possible, we ding the bell, and then we go to the next guest immediately. So, without further ado, let's bring on our very first guest. So we have the very first show that's coming back to start this whole thing off, and uh, we can set a timer, right? No timer, right? We can set a clock. We don't have a clock either. <laughs> the producers yelling, "No clock!" Are we ready for our first guest? You guys ready? Please welcome, ladies and gentlemen, and uh, by the way, we need to have a continuous clapping after the guests sit down, right? So uh, every guest needs clapping. So please welcome, Dean Settle. How's it going, Dean? Nice to see you again. All right, uh, let's ask a question here. Name some holidays that your friends may celebrate that you don't. Why is it so? Next question. Okay, thanks for being on the show, Dean. See you later. Oh, yeah, okay. Um, uh, what words would you use to describe being a parent? Uh, frustrating, fun, uh... Frustrating, <laughs> exciting, uh, frustrating, educational. Okay, uh, thank you. That thing's a lot Next guest. <laughs> Austin, what would you describe being a parent? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> when do you think a woman might be elected president? Never. Good. <laughs> Next guest. James. James. <laughs> James. <laughs> they will rule at home or school that he would like to change. Favorite talk show host of all time? Jimmy Fallon. Oh, that's <laughs> yes. <laughs> what kind of car did your parents first drive? At the same time? Yes, at the same time. I don't know of any car that you could drive at the same time. <laughs> what was your parents' first car? A Chevrolet. <laughs> Next guest. Elijah. Who would you be if you could be someone famous? Why do you choose this person? Next question. That wasn't even a part of the rules. What kind of bike did you ride when you were a child? Or what is your dream bike? Uh, a tricycle. What's my... I don't know. Define integrity. <laughs> you want to define integrity. How can parents best show their love for their children? Uh, loving them? By spanking them. Next guest. <laughs> If you could be any animal, what would it be and why? Um, I'll be a horse because they're beautiful and flowing. Yeah. Yes, yes. It's me again. What could you say to someone offering you cigarettes or drugs? <laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Lynn! Ia! What is the scariest thing you've ever done? Uh, I don't know. If you had to create a mission statement for your family, what would it be? I don't know. What is your favorite family tradition from your childhood? <laughs> what makes you feel most welcome when you get home? Um, people coming to say hi. Next guest! <laughs> Nick Lachey! I mean, <coughs> Nick, if you could change one thing about your appearance, what would it be and why? Oh, God. 
<laughs> There's nothing really wrong with your appearance. Don't worry about it. If everyone in your family became dogs, what kind of dogs would they be? Poodles all the way. Poodles all the way! When are you most frightened? What makes you feel better? Um, proving you wrong. <laughs> proving me wrong makes you feel better? Yes. Okay, when are you most frightened? Most yeah. No. What are you most frightened and what makes you feel better? <laughs> you said, what makes you feel most right? No. <laughs> <laughs> Name your ancestors. Where were they from? Don't do that. I don't care. <laughs> if you could change one thing about your parents, what would it be and why? By the way, how's your aunt? Never mind. <laughs> well, what would you put inside a time capsule to be open in a hundred years? A banana. <laughs> <laughs> why? Bananas are good. <laughs> That's horrible. Name a, name a change that was hard for you. Why was it hard? What did you learn? She's never changed. If you could have chosen, if you could have chosen your own first name, what would it be? Raquel. Raquel. Oh, it would be Larue. Larue? Why? Larue. Because it's an awesome name. A friend of mine gave me that name. Larue? Where were you when you went into labor or described receiving <laughs> adoption confirmation? Never mind. What is your favorite color? Purple. Yes, yes. Is there anybody else out there? Oh, yeah. There's somebody else out there. Um, what just happened? Did you see, do you see the cup uh, half full or half empty? Why? It depends. If you drink it out, it's half empty. If you pour it in, it's half full. <laughs> Philosopher Micah. How was your bedroom decorated when you were growing up? Was it clean or messy? So don't answer that, that's creepy. <laughs> Why would I ask that, you know? What were things like before ramps of accessibility? I'm asked that. What kind of compliments mean most to you? I don't know. I don't get those often. <laughs> <laughs> what, is the, uh, what foreign language would you like to speak? Elvish. What were some alternate names that you considered naming your children? Um, what do you think schools are like in other countries? I'm terrible. Name some holidays that your friends may not celebrate. Uh, what house, whose house is the most fun to visit? My house. <laughs> okay. Yeah. All right, next guest. Oh, I forgot. We're actually the next I'm not sure I got There's no next guest. Um, is it more rewarding to give or to receive? Why? <laughs> it's more rewarding to give. Why? Um, because it just makes you feel good, and it's. Uh, you know, I just it's because the Bible says so. <laughs> Here we How go. will you know? Oh, you... <laughs> How will you know when you are grown up? <laughs> <laughs> when you have your hair? Find out. <laughs> you when all my when all my hair is gone. <laughs> no, your hair is gone. What was your best family vacation? Um. Florida when I was 15. Name one goal you have for yourself. Um, I'd like to grow my hair back. <laughs> <laughs> have you... <laughs> really? No. Okay, no, I was no, no, say, no. don't ever do that. Uh, have you ever been... <laughs> the next time you're on the show, you need to have that white stuff on your head. Anyway, have you ever been homesick? What made you feel better? <laughs> yes, I've been homesick and going home with me. <laughs> <laughs> Are we done? We good? All right. That was Noah Mocky Year in Review. We'll see you next time, or we'll be right back. We'll we'll tell you. You keep watching. Bye bye. Do you like what you see? Like.